being a little bit of a prepper and a survivalist and um, you know I pride myself on being able to make it through the nitty-gritty it's currently super cold and snowing uh, up in the woods and uh, we gotta it's been raining all day so everything's wet everything is absolutely soaking wet and uh, we're trying to start a fire here and uh, tried and true tried and true technique just like the Indians did it back in the day. Flamethrower! We like to keep it old school around here. Out here at the fire, Kyle's processing his deer that he got. Shout out to Kyle first time. Got one and we are currently cooking up a slab of its ribs for a little snacky poos. So we're gonna smoke them a little bit. It's not a ton of meat on deer ribs and it's very lean meat, but we got a little bit of fat on there. See if we can't burn some of that off and use it for cooking. Waste either. No. Yeah, it uh, decided to snow on us while we're processing. So, uh. Makes it that much more authentic. Yeah. Yeah, if it wasn't difficult, it wouldn't be right. So, Kyle's working on. Is that the front shoulder blade? Yeah. One of them. The Already got one. another one done. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking we could just take another Ziploc bag, put it over that, and then tape it. Yeah, that's like Duct this tape one. it or whatever. But. And as to not wait, want not waste not, can I uh, get those bones all processed up for my dog, my brother's dog? Everybody's eating. Everybody's eating.